complaints on deplorable working conditions from a number of workers in the public service are being registered with the Public Workers Union. Union leader Brian Grimes says a major concern in these reports are links to intimidation of employees in response to their occupational health and safety concerns. A number of workers are forced to function in environments that, are an, that pose an imminent danger to them and they are intimidated because they feel if they stand up or they stand outside in relation to that, um, their jobs may be at stake. The PW president says they have stated openly that occupational health and safety will be priority for the executive. What kind of country are we in if a worker protected by the labor code under the Employment Act decides to utilize his or her legal rights and literally has to wonder if there will be repercussions that will prevent him or her um, from earning bread, earning a living. Graham says the PW is calling on government, who is the employer, to not only pay on time but to ensure workers are comfortable and safe. He notes contract work is a major hindrance to be put in such cases. And the contracts are up for renewal. They may think twice and they may suffer themselves in environments that can have detrimental effects on their health going forward just so themselves and their family can eat. What kind of society is this? Um, this is just a step below slavery as far as the union is concerned. This is what we call indentured um, servitude, not far from slavery. The union is also asking government to actively address the conditions of the workplace. I am Gerard Joseph for GBN News.